My friend Kuehl, we need to start this video by bringing important and controversial information that happened in the last few hours involving Barcelona and one of its players, and at the end of this video I want you to give me your opinion on this subject here in the comments. In the last few hours all the newspapers started to spread the news that midfielder Ilkay Gundogan asked to leave Barcelona, and I come here to tell you that some newspapers exaggerated, but in part, this story can be considered true. It turns out that Ilkay Gundogan spoke to Hansi Flick and expressed his concern about having fewer minutes than he would like due to the excess of players in the club's midfield at the moment, mainly several of them in development that will consequently gain more opportunities. The newspapers add that Hansi Flick would have been clear and direct with Gundogan, where the coach said he wants to count on the player but that no one has guaranteed minutes at a club the size and level of Barcelona, so now it's up to Gundogan whether he actually chooses to leave or not. In your opinion, do you think Ilkay Gundogan's departure would hurt Barcelona? Do you think he should stay? Leave your opinion here in the comments. Now let's move on to the main news, exclusive last minute bomb. Given this news about the possible departure of Ilkay Gundogan and other players such as Ansu Fati, Vitor Roque, Lenglet and Mika Fey, if these departures actually materialize, Barcelona will open up a lot of space in its salary limit and will have financial fair play left over to sign a high-level star for its squad. As Barcelona highlighted that their priority is to sign a left-wing striker, so if Barcelona makes these five sales and has enough money to buy a football star to play in that position that the club wants to reinforce, the club currently has Luis Diaz from Liverpool and Rafael Leal from Milan as options for this. Nico Williams is also an option, however, the player is no longer a priority and the other two names mentioned are bigger targets than Nico Williams at the moment. So, in your opinion, if Barcelona makes these five sales and can buy one of these two players, which one would you prefer Barcelona to buy, Luis Diaz or Rafael Leal? Or, if you think there is a better option for the left wing than Luis Diaz and Rafael Leal, leave your name suggestion here in the comments and I will be reading. See you in the next video.